The Iranian Armed Forces on September 21 unveiled a new class of single-use, kamikaze, drone, the Shahed 136B, which promises to revolutionize the country's ability to launch very low-cost long-range precision strikes. The unveiling follows multiple successes by older and shorter-range Iranian kamikaze drone. The strike on Saudi saw several layers of Western-supplied air defenses left effectively useless, and represented a significant show of force. The Shahed 136 is a single-use asset designed to use its explosive-laden body as a weapon, hence gaining them the name, kamikaze, or, suicide, drones as they are conceptually a hybrid between an unmanned aircraft and a cruise missile. Such aircraft are considerably less costly than cruise missiles, where the baseline Shahed 136 drone exported to Russia had a 2,500 km range. The Shahed 136B variant boasts a much extended 4,000 km range and carries a significantly larger warhead. The drone also makes use of a turbojet engine, making it more similar to a cruise missile, and boasts improved stealth capabilities. The ability to engage targets up to 4,000 km away allows Iran to engage targets deep into European territory including U.S. and allied military bases and other key infrastructure. Examples of targets within reach include Ramstein Air Base in Germany, Camp Bondsteel in former Yugoslavia, and Mihail Kobelnisianu Air Base in Romania, all of which are key to the Western Bloc's ability to project power. The significance of this reach is only greater when considering that this can be done with a very low-cost asset that can be deployed in tremendous numbers, and represents a strategic game-changer for Iran's ability to deter potential Western attacks, and if necessary retaliate against them. Iran was previously thought to have gained a medium-range strike capability through acquisitions of early variants of the North Korean HWASONG-10 ballistic missile in the mid-2000s, and has since developed longer-ranged missiles with Korean support. The vast majority of its missile arsenal, however, can only reach regional targets such as U.S. bases in the Persian Gulf or arms depots in Israel. A 4,000 km range single-use drone has the potential to be highly attractive to a wide range of clients. In Russian hands it would place almost all of Western Europe within reach, while if deployed by North Korea it would complement its existing ballistic missile strike capabilities aimed at Guam. With the new drone having little in common with the original Shahed 136, it remains a significant possibility that the use of the designation Shahed 136B is intended to capitalize on the significant publicity which the older and much smaller drone class has gained from its operations in the Ukrainian theater in order to better market the new class for export. With Iran lacking an ability to strike the United States mainland as Russia and North Korea can, the ability to strike targets in Europe is particularly important to deterring possible Western assaults. Following Western military assaults on Iraq, Libya, Syria and other states around the world outside its sphere of influence, which have consistently devastated the targeted countries, deterring the West has been a central focus of Iranian military planning. Although Iran's defense sector has consistently failed to achieve large-scale production of promised new conventional systems such as tanks and fighter aircraft, drones have proven to be a particular strength of the country's industries. Alongside kamikaze drones, the advanced stealth capabilities of its flying wing combat, reconnaissance and transport drones having made a particularly strong impression on the country's adversaries.